What's up, y'all? This is the beginning of a video series that I want to do called Games That Should Come Back. Um, and I got actually a very iconic character um, that I want to see come back. I really want to see this character come back in its original form like it was in the PS1. But you know, upgraded for modern times. Crash Bandicoot. We know the first, second, and third one. And after it hit the PS2, we had Wrath of Cortex. Then we had Twin Sen Sanity. But at, when, when Naughty Dog sold the iconic character, it went downhill. All the character models changed. That already I didn't like at all. I didn't like how they changed the, the look of the characters. I understand having it changed a little bit because over time it gets old, but having it changed so much, it made Crash literally look like a fucking moron. His character model now just does not look good at all. The one in fucking Crash Bandicoot, in the, in the old Crash Bandicoots, it looked, he looked like a dumbass, but he looked sick. He looked like a badass, I'm sorry. And to me, he looked like a badass. And, you know, uh, after it went to the PS2 and it, it was sold, it just, I didn't, I didn't like it, I stopped playing it, and it killed me because it was one of my childhood things. Like, that's probably the first game I ever, no, it was the first game I ever played on the PS1. Uh, PS1 was my first console to have, and I had Crash Bandicoot 3, uh, Crash Bandicoot worked. And, um, when I played that, oh god, I, I fucking became a gamer right then and there. That game was fucking beautiful, gorgeous, interactive, it was just fun. I loved it. And to see it change so much, so dramatically, the game just wasn't the same. They even changed the way the game was played. I liked how in the old ones, you had this warp, this teleporter or something you had to go through, and you were brought to these unique short-leveled worlds, and, you know, they were side-schooling or they were straight, you know what I'm saying? And then in the, in the newer ones, they just walk around, you know, and so, some of them, they got rid of the, the turn, the little fucking tornado attack. Why? That was fucking Crash Bandicoot's iconic fucking attack. That's what he does. And it took it away. I don't know, maybe other people, like, I've got, I got fucking uh, spammed one time in comments, uh, a long time ago when I put that on a video, uh, I think it was the Twin Sanity, the Twin Sanity, uh, fucking review for, uh, Crash Bandicoot. <coughs> and so many people hit on, uh, bashing me about my opinion. All I said was I didn't like how they changed it. I wish it could go back to the old times and how I think that these, uh, games sucked. I just didn't like them. I don't like these, the, these games. And then I got bashed for an opinion. I didn't say anything bad about it. I just said I didn't like it and I hated the game. And I wanted to see the review on it to see if, like, if I was even slightly right to the reviewer. But, you know, he liked it. I just gave my opinion and I got bashed for it. I don't know. Maybe maybe just because I'm a, I'm, I'm a true fan to the character. I fucking love Crash. But I hated seeing them destroy his image, destroy what it, what it was. It wasn't the same game. And Spyro ended up going through the same shit. <sighs> what happened? After the first three... <whistles> it, same thing, it was the same pattern as Crash. First three for PS1. Then they had... Uh... Fuck, uh, the drag... The fucking... I forgot what it was called. The one with the dragonfly. Uh, that they had that one for the PS2, and then they, uh, then they had, uh, I think there was two more that, that act that had it similar and had it a uh, kind of right, and then they completely changed Spyro completely to like, uh, the fucking, the, I don't know, I, I can't remember the names of them off my head, but you know what I mean, they had the, they, they, they had these iconic characters that everyone know, knew and loved and they changed them so dramatically and changed the game when that's not what we loved about the first, uh, first generation of them. I just wish that one day maybe Naughty Dog would buy back Crash Bandicoot and the original company Aspire, I forgot which one, buys back or if they still own it, change 
Spiral. I don't know if they sold Spiral to a new company. I don't know. But if they, if they have them, I just hope that they turn them back to how they first were when they first were on the PS1. Not the same character models. Change them. But keep them similar to what they were. But make them look updated and clean and all fucking nice. Hell, I would buy an HD remix of the fucking original games. I loved them. They were the fucking best games on the PS1 when I was a child. I loved them. And it sucked to see them getting taken, get, got, get taken away and changed so much. Let me know what you think. Um, this is just episode one of the characters I think, or the games that I think should come back in their original form. I just, I just do. Crash Bandicoot was never the same after it left the PS1. Crash Bandicoot 1 revolutionized the gaming people. The fuck, they, they loved the character. Then 2 came out, which was a bomb. And fucking 3, which just topped them all. 3, I think, was the best one. It was the first one I ever played. And I loved that game to death. And I would buy, and I would buy it again. I would buy all of them if they were in the fucking PS3 fucking HD DVD. If they have all the original crashes and... Even the, put in the PS2 ones if you can. It doesn't matter. Even put the PS2 ones and have the PS1s included. I'll buy it. I just want to be able to see the character as its true form. Anyway, thanks for uh, watching. Tell me what you think. And I'm sorry for the fan blowing. It was very hot. This shirt is the thinnest and lightest material shirt I have. And I pretty much was shirtless the whole day. And I'm going to fucking take this off again after I'm done with this video so that I can relax and not fucking be hot as hell. Thank you for this fan. But I'm sorry I made it made noise. But I, 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 you're able to hear me, so whatevs. But anyway, tell me what you think about Crash Bandicoot and Spyro. Or tell me any characters or games that you wish could come back in the true form on how they were. And, you know, let me know. Let me know what, what games you think you should come back and tell me what you think about the characters. So, peace out guys, thanks for watching, and see you guys next time.